Cause your teeth, you have to brush. And how to brush? I, I, I put videos because I would like to bring prop, props with me, but it's in Brazil. <laughs> Oh, it's not this video. Uh, no. Oh. <coughs> hmm? It's not this video. Yeah. So, uh, first of all, take a. Um, a soft to brush tool to avoid injury in your gum. So always, always take a soft one. And the angle you put your uh, brush, it's 45. Yeah. And you will start in a rotation movement. Okay. Yeah, doing a rotation movement to remove the bacteria and the plague between your teeth and your gum in this area. Because the decay or the gum disease starts in this area, in the limit of the gum and the teeth part. So, incline your brush 45 in angle and it starts to rotation. You can do a different movement. Start from the gum to the tip of the teeth. You can do that too. All the, you can't forget. You can clean. You have to clean all the faces: the front face, the back face, and the left side and the right side. Just to be more um, easy, start with the right side upper, and then go to the left side upper, and then go to the uh, low teeth. Lowers, okay. and the last part it's the tongue. Yeah, I'm gonna pause this part because it um, there is a, a very interesting information. People usually brush, floss, but forget to clean the tongue, and more than forty percent of the bad breath comes from the tongue. So. In the end, don't forget to clean your, your tongue. You can use your brush or there is a special tool to clean the tongue. The important is do it. Okay? After floss, uh, I would like to show you one video. Uh, I don't know if because I'm a dentist or not, but it's when I saw this video the first time, it was very shocking for me. So I would like you would pay attention in, in this video. In many ways, your mouth is the gate between the outside world and the rest of your body. Your mouth is teeming with billions of bacteria. There are more bacteria in your mouth right now than there are people on Earth. Over time, these bacteria can stick together and multiply. They form a colony, and the colonies can then join together, forming a thick layer called a plaque biofilm. This can eventually spread across every surface of your entire mouth. Your teeth, your gums, your cheeks and your tongue. Every small space in your mouth provides the perfect environment for bacteria to thrive and for the plaque biofilm to grow, which it can do dramatically over the course of a single day. Your mouth's inflammatory cells are activated to kill the bacteria, but the bacteria can build strong defenses within the colony to stay alive. These inflammatory cells, which are designed to protect the body, can then cause harm in the form of gum inflammation, also known as gingivitis, the earliest stage of gum disease. People with diabetes are even more susceptible to gum disease because their blood vessels 
a compromise. The area between your teeth and gums is densely packed with intricate blood vessels. Normal everyday activities can burst those tiny vessels. Then pieces of the plant biofilm and bacteria can detach and mix with the blood, giving bacteria from the surface of your mouth full access to the rest of your body. And for people with severe gum disease, new science suggests that these bacteria may link to other disorders, like heart disease, where bacteria may be involved in plaque buildup in the blood vessels, or pneumonia, where bacteria can create an infection in your lungs, or rheumatoid arthritis, a debilitating disease of inflammation in the joints, or preterm low birth weight in infants, which may be linked to bacteria passed from the mother to her fetus. Good oral care may positively affect your overall health, which is important because what happens in your mouth may not stay in your mouth. Uh, it's basically uh, what I said in the beginning of my presentation, just to illustrate for you the importance of taking care of the bacteria uh, from our mouth can uh, reach our, the rest of the, our body. Okay, So uh, that's why I try to convince you why you should brush your teeth, and if you don't, what can happen with you, and how to floss properly, and how to brush properly because if your mouth is healthy, healthy is you. <laughs>